lie you, I won't take it out to New York and live a high life like a nigga signed with high bridge. I flash out and take his head from out his body. I never once showed you that side, but that's who I'm is. I know I let that daddy speak on college. If I die right now, just take the steps and see how I did. I'm a real street nigga. Yeah. I just pull my red eye out and try to stop a nigga. I just walked outside my house and I'm gonna shot a nigga. Fuck my ex, I hope my nigga can probably top a nigga. Take me to a place I can't imagine. Make them more heartbreak and I'm so damn. Thank you, baby, for another episode of Smoking and Winning. It's been a minute, I know, but the kid got COVID, so you know how to get my mind and my body right. So for that, I had to step away from the za for a second. And, you know, I had to continue making episodes for y'all, so that's why you was getting hella road to GMs. But we're going to start playing subscribers again, and we're going to start smoking and winning again. And I'm thinking about adding a new series, and that way we'll have four just in the mix. So, we are currently at 48 subscribers. We're two away from 50, baby. Oh, my God. I think we can hit it by tomorrow. I think we can hit that 50 by tomorrow. So, today, we are playing... I'm not even going to attempt to say that, but my opponent from India, who is 1265, um, yeah, let's get it jumping, let's go, so he started out with e4, e5, the usual man, he plays knight to f3, and I play knight to c6, he pushes that pawn, not wanting me to jump forward with my knight, I wasn't planning on doing that anyway, goofball, so I developed my other knight, attacking that pawn, and he def Ugh, fuck, lost my train of thought. But he develops his knight defending it. I push that pawn because you know you know I like these, baby. You know that's how I get down. He brings his bishop out, and I push my pawn, not wanting him to jump forward and get some bullshit fried liver going. He pushes a pawn. I bring out my bishop. He castles. And I push my pawn. Boy, you know I got to get an attack going, baby. You know I got to get it jumping. He pushes a pawn, and I d open the door for my light score bishop. So now I'm seeing shit. I'm seeing a potential sack. He develops his knight. I chop, and he takes with his bishop. And here, I go and attack his knight. And if he takes, I'll take, and he's going to open up, weaken his king. So that's that was my thought process during that. He takes, I take, and now I'm pinning his knight to his queen. He takes my knight with check, so I just take that bishop back with my pawn. He's trying to push one of these pawns, and to defend that, we play queen to f6. So if he pushes this, we'll have dink, dink, but then I'll take this knight, so that will stop defending it, and then bink, bink, and we're going to win something. And if he goes here, we'll go take, 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 and if he takes... We're smacking your rook across the face. Here, he pushes that pawn. So I take, he takes, and just like I said, give me that horse. And he takes with his queen. So, let's trade queens. Easy, easy peasy. We damage your structure, and now I get a free pawn. He develops his bishop trying to attack it, and I just slide it back. And he just keeps attacking me. So I go give him a check. He's on the back corner now he's on the or not the back rank but he's on the side rank he's on that h file and he's trapped there so i slide my bishop back he's just coming at me full force so i take 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 i'm up two pawns now like fuck wrong with him he brings his king i push my pawn and he's getting ready to get some bullshit going so i just slide my king out the way i don't want to be pinned by anything like none of that that's not appealing to me he goes straight for my bishop, and I bring it back, and he's just pushing, like, what are you doing? So I bring my rook up, and he takes that pawn. Bro, that's not a free pawn, baby. That's not a free pawn. And I see it's mate in six, but I didn't peep that. But I did find a way to win his bishop. So he brings his king out the way. Give me that bishop for the free ski. Fuck wrong with dude. He's trying to trade off rooks, and I go and check him with my other rook. He slides out the way, and I go and take that uh, rook. He takes, and now I give him a check. Now let's just trade pieces off. Let's get this. Let's finish this game. I love the end game, baby. I love it.
So I go and bring my rook back, very pivotal to prevent from any checks. He can't give me any. He goes and attacks those pawns, and I go and push it. He brings his king, and I go and attack this pawn, threatening check. He defends it, and I slide my king over. He gives me a check, but the whole point, I wanted to bring my king here anyway, so he just helped me. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. He goes and attacks my bishop, but you must have forgot something, son. You must have forgot something. Give me that. Check. What wrong with do? Yeah, and now I'm winning your goddamn, I'm winning your rook. He slides out the way. Give me that rook for the free ski. Fuck wrong with dude. And he resigned, man. I can't get a full game for you guys. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm smacking these motherfuckers across the face. I'm sorry. But that's the end of this video. Please like and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one.